Welcome, hello, and welcome to today's Milo Murphy vlog for the second day in a row, and hopefully probably won't be one for a little bit. Anyway, go. These should be fairly quick to talk about. Go. Today, go. go we start with um, Wart di Warped Day with my Joshua Pure Pure Pure. How do you pronounce it? Um, he yeah, did. I'm going for that one. In the cup code, it is Career Day, and eventually Milo has to want to figure out what job he wants. But of course, he kind of confused on what he wants and. Going, going through to current play game to f figure it out and kind of make new choice any better. Meanwhile, better to get an entire subplot of Potassio Boy in the cup go trying to get the Potassio to Potassio Warehouse. I could probably just talk about that first. Yeah, they went from having a couple of minor roles to having an entire subplot in the cup of code. It took them out to a ton, and they don't even have the plot, so. They are a clue to do some parry thing in the show, but they don't even interact with the main story in the cup code. Um, well, they kind of do, but they all affect the main story. They end up at the hospital at one point, but that's about it. But, but that shit boy is still awesome. They have been playing great chemistry in them, and they got some very good, funny jokes with them, with the way they play out. I don't know. Like, yeah, I don't know. Like, you know, see, one guy, Cavendish can they mention, don't know who's who, but... I like one Dakota, but the Cavendish could name it in the company. You um, know, I like the running gag about the guy constantly like wanting like food, like trying, you know, like lunch and night. And uh, they they are a highlight of young guys in humor. Um, probably no calling in this one or the other one. Go so guess that freak has finally been broken. Go so walk like with a guy when they feel like it, and that's fine. Um. Um, but yeah, we had, I, I did not bet them to Peter, not only again, but it has a have giant, a major couple, it was not crazy huge, it's still a couple on the upcode. Go. And I check guard book watches for time, who don't even know in the background, or haven't read any practice with that, we'd be like, why are we kind of here? For a game to get that guy and give a note. Um, but I think they work because they're pretty funny. I love this guy, I can't wait to see more of them. Um, and for the main plot, that's pretty good too. Um. Again, it does work to be the moral of, you know, you know, picture of one thing, you can try out things throughout your life, yada yada. But, you know, it's still a nice moral. And being a joke, my favorite joke, and got the end where he'd go home, he'd go, he'd go, D.O.G. go home. Oh, wait, you're already home. <laughs> I knew we were going to do something like that eventually, and I love it. Uh, I don't know, that's a good joke. At the only joke, a few times in the cup code, but not in the other one. Don't even going to appear. So, why don't we talk about the other one? Um... <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, but it's all a good joke with again that pig can come back and some good joke with wait when you get a story and DOG we get to be got mom and doctor or doctor and cat mom um and um apparent uh, you yeah um clunky brown pig league money got because I'm not sure which one but um uh, Ag Dung Every winter, I don't know who she wake up. There's no thing for a week after entering the story. Question. Um, I don't know who she wake up. We all go get looking dad, who doesn't seem like Milo that much. Um, he doesn't kind of like a fire, peak fireman, a fireman broke out where he works and go, Milo, were you here earlier? And I'm like, he's so judgmental. But I like it. Um, <laughs> we get to keep more of my parents because they're big and full so far. They get combated with me. But his dad worked by Jesus Bader, which I like. Um, the other thing from Metro Tent, yeah, uh, Albert, um, and Van Ford, um, and the totally tool guy, Perry, at the book. Yeah, so, go. He got, um, what did he, he worked at the factory thing, I don't know. And, um, yeah, um, they have to definitely spread this mile and cut, um, I can't, yeah, um, Wait a minute, didn't the king get to make up a code by Peril that my uncle dad and something, something, we're not a fireman, apparently. Um, <laughs> so maybe he quit a job constantly? I don't know. That'd be a good one, Gag. Every up could enter a job. But, um, um, it's cool, cool to see. Um, yeah, um, yeah. I think it's another fun up code. It got some good jokes, but it definitely, that more thing, even though it makes you guys think it works, it gives. A little bit more to work with and get more of a story. A story is the backdrop of all happening, but of course, could we get different locations as they go from like, we have the hospital, we have the factory thing, yeah. Go so overall, a pretty go. Yeah, big kick, but got other stuff to it, like potential wings that make it stand out and be entertaining. 
that really off the game for War Today. Now for V Wilder West. Not Wilder West, V Wilder West. Where they go, where the gang go to a dude ranch. And while there, they have come on one. But of course, um, they shouldn't have happened when Gak did go crush on the dude ranch girl. And because of that, they end up getting into some dangerous situations. While meanwhile, Kara convinced that the place they're at will be film location for an episode of Dr. Gone. And she tried to, you know, convince, you know, that to her, to the other fans. Dr. Gone fans, you know. So, I thought that was Kara. Bought first. Um, the fan, some of the fans from Dr. Go File Epico Return, and I didn't talk about them in the episode, but two of them are with my Mitchell Musco and Alex Stoner. And I didn't even know it was them. Better than Stoner, she hired away from Mitchell Musco. Maybe because he had a fight. I do it because you kind of like, when you first hear it, you might not know it, but once you know it, you hear it. Um, they play with these douchebag fans, and especially, those people got the gift to chick. It is great. So, I like that. I like that they're here. And uh, I forgot to mention them because I didn't know of them. Wayne Brady appeared in week one of the couple codes, but I don't know who you voiced. Um, but again, everything for, again, all things for people. Um, the all are really making actually since they own it. Well, what's she working on? They can get her. Uh, Tom Hanks are also be good to get. By the way, two no Bradley. Have three production up, you know, half hours in a gonna row with no Bradley. I mean, I, we do need to pick out appearances, but. Come on, give him something to do. Uh, I feel like he could have had a good role in the first one. Um, anyway, I can't run a couple of games, but it does have kind of like a funny direction, you know, especially with a resolution to it. It's interesting, still delightful. Um, um, while there is no Kong, you hear that I'm going to find a theme in Toronto Line in the Gump Code Go. No, we're Kong too, but no, on Betrayal, which I wish for didn't. <laughs> Yeah, we're moving, making thing and get the cow walk on the thing. You mean well? Uh, I might have that up a little bit. I come, come tell me that you can be cute. Come people point out, come be cute things from our new tier. Um, um, but now we're trying to make something that can be used here. So, uh, yeah. But the big drive for that uh, yeah, one, both location and fat guy crush on the girl who apparently just kind of claim Jane. And they can, even though we knew it in canon, that the first time they mentioned Milo being a candidate of Sean Murphy. Um, you know, and it's like, they will get human cat in canon until now. Go back, cool. Um, it's better to get over from because she's taken away from one. Um, and she's a fun Cowie as a character, but she's better to be the Bakuri one up the level trend. Um, I think we're going to a couple of being like with Charles Pippen. You know, his brother Tim Curry, go oh, he will go better than Jerry. <laughs> Um, I'll play back in the screen and show, give him a song. You drop the ball big time by having him in two epico with freak character and eat. Three characters all together, not having him king. In a musical show. But I'll have that Richard O'Brien and Barry Bostick who king. How'd that happen? Go pit to the screen show and have him king. Gosh dang it. <laughs> um, the whole thing. Um, um anyway, go, how the gag. Um, Kim on Gak, oh my. Yeah, crush thing. Really has to just be a code, having him a ring little crush and kind of weird. But for me, I think it, personally, this one kind of works because they do play some fun guy because he doesn't like getting into all the stuff because he likes Kareem wanting to get all the stuff. And we really like watching Cougar for Coco Bob. And by the end, we have to go, yeah, I don't know what I go after in the end. The end. Because in the end, he kind of stopped liking her. Which will hopefully prevent some people from getting worked up over Because if Changar, she got one shot, or will keep be a big player again. Well, Amanda, we know that could at least have a few episodes again. Um, I don't want to talk about some of the stuff. Apparently, we're going to discussion over yet to get good, and, um, yeah. Yeah. And, of course, when I call it, the guy from the other went, oh, you gotta be kidding me. But hopefully, and, and, and here it gives more to me to get a lot of wild left stuff for Gavat, where it gives more dragon points. Well, here it is like a little bit of a cup of cup of But, um, overall, it's a fun episode. I want to point that thing that crazy hook to it, because, again, it's like the hook in, but it got enough potassium. Like, the, I don't, I think Pipe in the background, I don't get any attention. It's long, but it's like a good location, and we do a lot of good jokes with it, you know. You know, especially with Kevin Gatling Guard. And, you know, um, you know, and I like how even, I like the joke where parents, when they 
They forget Scarlet Twain. Because yeah. oh, apparently she got a phone credit, like, tied to her up the moon thing, so it's not, like, a randomly out of the thing. Um, I get the get, get the character do two acting for Sean and the of course, but honestly, in that episode, I don't, okay, only, only the scout was for it. Everything else was really well. So, that's the end of the time of that episode. But, here, but anyway, this is a fun episode. A fun, wild west story, even though there's not a whole lot to it. Um, DOT's not even in it. It feels like they're trying to drop off current Parker formula, but it doesn't make it. But I like the old West Ketting for a lot of good jokes. Um, and I like how Panic when they get very apparently at the count, like, Mall was going next door, and they come home and they, like, apparently they broke a lot of things that they had to buy. Go. Uh, and I, I don't know if I mentioned before, but apparently, the, in the Murphy family, Murphy family, it could be small, but only the male. Apparently, they have a symptom gene. <laughs> um, uh, which, you know. Which uh, well, apparently affected just Peter with that. But um, that parents don't appear more often. That kind of issue. Because before they knew, apparently I came up an hour trying to appear more often. Um, so that, that's good. Going for all Wild West, V Wild West, I'm sorry. Oh, but I think I'm going to try. Remember, Danny Ventry, Yoko wrote the Amanda Milet from yesterday. Oh, joy. People are going to feel like that one. Ventry, but what's that from for that? The Undergrounder, yeah. Hmm. Some sort of B tier in some way, but. Uh, move operator got to um, favorite. Um, and yeah, more thing. Uh, between the two, I would work better. This one, I like the location, and that makes it out. That one's a kind of stronger plot and better joke. And then Potassio Boy, who are quickly kind of my favorite character. Because we just go weird. And we get that. Uh, and apparently, in the future, Potassio needs protecting until we don't. I wonder when that thing of. Uh, when we're. I wonder if we're going to wait to call him into a direct one, or what? I mean, who knows? Um, we don't know how long the King is going to be, but I think for 20-ish half hours, like, the short King and the King one with 20 half hours, I'm going to be on that length. With a few 22 minutes, I wonder, the X version will be Holly special for next year, which means the show is going to be high, it's going to be yeah, Finny has a few of them. So, but there is work today, guys, for a while to wrap it up. Not the great pairing up, but we have one pretty strong one, one pretty fun one. A lot of good gag, and the only thing they dread to really. And there are a few bits have been going too long, but only a few minor bits. Like, coming out when you can tell it's running time, because some of the individual lines get multiple going for a few seconds longer than that. Yeah, yeah, but it's more notable in Party of Barrel than any other so far. Which, I, that dried that one down. Something about, I don't quite slow to me. And I think the story, the, if story, that'd be probably one of my favorite, because the comedy really strong. That was fairly strong. Um, more today, I like better than that one. Um, Go, but either way, you can find pairing up and go, and hopefully no one get crazy over him, because, again, if, if more can be one try, or at least they won't, and he going to not like to go, like, because she kind of crazy with Coco Buff. Either way, very good. I, I knew the Wild West would be about some kind of Wild West town, two edge thing, and doing more today, should have guessed that was about. Anyway, a fun pairing up and go. Now, ton to K, but hey, giving cool stuff K will back up and come in the location of it. Go, very cool short one because we're gonna have much to K. Um, uh, what day will matter a lot of that one, people. Um, don't know when the tough could is. Next Monday, Halloween. I don't know if we're gonna have any in November at all. But I guess we'll have, we got to key, um, in a few days, we'll be at the other thing will be up and hopefully it won't lie in the time. Then we'll find out if any plan to be for November. If not, I hope Pengaro will come back in November. At this point, it's not going to happen, but it's better. I want more Pengaro. And, I, you know, I do wonder if what the consistent day for my will be on for now on, if it would be a channel. Like, will it be on Monday, or Monday, or Friday, or what? Because I don't want Vic and Pengaro on the same day if they start on the same day, because, you know, they come in different. Milo and most I mean, could show appear on the app around, like, the night 1 a.m., where I am the night before, so I could... One of them I can watch it then, and of course be on the end. Yeah, but um, that complication, maybe they won't even look at that often, hopefully not. But either way, that take up going, and hopefully November might will come back. I don't want to wait too long. Either way, better. Anyway, we can go fun. No, it's okay. Good, got to up. Go. Doing fun. Pina can think for a while, except for that cap for a little bit. And now we don't want to like play more. Only because of the introduction of that guy. That and we're going and that one took kind of funny again, we think, but they're both um um the end of corrupt song star is finished going in. Yeah, that, yeah that's more fun than you might remember. So I think Rock Fleet is cool. Um 
I wonder if I ever think of anything else. Well, I can't wait for the upload about, um, um, fuck. About, well, Mingo. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna cook the off. Um, Captain Vlog from on Saturday, and no idea if Vlog will be after that. Be oh, after that, we'll cook Vlog, and after that, who knows, depending on Mama if he comes back. Mm. I don't think you know. So, either way, I should keep you all guys in.